Okay, so we're going to be using um, our multimeter up there and we're going to be using it on the, and hopefully you can see it, on the ohms setting. And we got a couple of wires coming out of it and they go right down to, well we'll get it here in just a minute, uh, but we're going to use a speaker wire uh, for this because it may be uh, quite a bit easier. And on the end here I've got a banana plug on the end, uh, which it's got the uh, openings there in the center. Um, we're going to put the uh, probes into it and all we're going to do is connect it uh, directly into one of the um, NL4 connections there. We're going to stick the probes in here, uh, negative and positive, and we're going to connect our NL4 connection into into the input. That's all there is to it. So, I'll see nothing's on, I mean, nothing's power. We're not doing anything. So if we come down here and take a look at this, uh, this is showing, now there may be a little bit of a resistance issue because the wire over there is swinging a little bit, but it shows us 2.8, high two is a low three, is actually a four ohm load. So when looking at this, this cabinet's a four ohm load and the fact that it's reporting something is showing that there's no breaks in the line. So uh, let's say what's coming in here is coming out the other side. Everything is, there's continuity between uh, the whole system. So that's how you can tell if we're looking at a four ohm load. Now if this was an eight ohm speaker, you'd probably uh, be looking around maybe mid sixes would show up here, possibly a seven that would represent an eight ohm load. But this is how you can do a real quick uh, test on it. And as I said, this only works on cabinets that do not have crossover. Let's say you're out someplace and uh, for whatever reason, your microphones don't work or you only brought one microphone and it broke and you need to use a microphone. No worries, you can actually use a set of headphones as a microphone. And that is because the uh, speakers in the headphones are actually um, microphones. They work the same way. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to plug our headphones into there. And this also works with a console. And I'm just using a uh, powered speaker here just as an example. But it does work with a console. And we're going to set our uh, setting over there for mic instead of line. And then we're also going to set the high pass filter. Now the sound quality isn't that good, but it does work. So let me let me show you here. A little bit of volume. Test one two. Test one two. Check check check. One two. One two. There you go. There's a quick little emergency microphone for you. Okay. Hope this helps.